Hello, my name is Dr. DeVries, and I'm here to talk to you about an interscalene or supracavicular nerve block to control post-operative pain, and on occasion, we actually use it for the surgical technique itself. We use an ultrasound machine in your neck region to find a bundle of nerves in there called the brachial plexus. When we first get the needle tip in place, we deliver a bolus or a large amount of medicine that will last about 12 to 24 hours. We then set a very small catheter through the needle, pull the needle out, tape that catheter in place and send you home with a pump infusing numbing medicine for the first two days post-operatively. Typically the next morning when you wake up there is a little less numbness down the arm than the day before because that bolus has worn off and now you just have the pump delivering its infusion which is the same medicine just a much lesser amount. Once the infusion is done that's when it's time to pull the catheter out so in about uh, 44 to 48 hours the pump will be out of its medicine and it's time to go ahead and peel the tape up removing the catheter and dispose of everything in the garbage. But there is still lingering effects of the block that last approximately 48 hours. The pump has 44 hours of medicine in it and it does typically take a couple hours for the block to wear off once the pump is done with its infusion. So typically your block will last about two days.